Good morning, beauties. How y'all doing today? I am coming on here for an update on all the things. Um, dead investing, savings, um, you know, stuff like that. So, I want to come on here and um, let y'all know that, y'all, I need to go get some water. I really do. Hold on, y'all. Hold on. Okay, I'm back, y'all. I just got done on with my bike, my inside bike, and I'm just so, uh And I want to try to record this video for my daughter's wake up. But anyway, y'all, I wanted to come on here real quick and say, y'all, I'm doing much better with that migraine. Thank y'all so much for all the prayers and asking about me and stuff like that. But yeah, I'm doing good. Um, but I want to come on here and let y'all know that I don't just do savings challenges. I do savings. I do a lot of savings challenges because I enjoy them. I like to do them like uh, y'all know I have like a holiday binder and I'm also saving for my daughter's graduations because I have a high school and a college grad that'll be graduating at the same time next year. So I do savings challenges for that, but I'm also going to be doing, um, uh, savings challenges to try to pay down my debt because, um, if y'all caught my last video, I told y'all that I was going to be doing this hard time June. Let me try to, uh, hold on y'all. Hold on. Oh, I went in too much. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm trying to work this thing and don't know how. But anyway, uh, I'm trying to do a hard time June to try to pay this debt down for our truck and our ortho bill for our daughter's braces. But I just want to let y'all know that that's not all I do. Before I do savings challenges, y'all, I always pay my bills. I pay on the debt that we have. We have an automatic investing and um, uh, savings that we do. For our uh just regular savings well not our regular savings okay we have a regular savings which i never discuss we have um like two or three of those but the savings that i'm talking about on here that i'll be discussing is the one that we have in our capital one okay those savings and um i think that's it y'all so i just want to let y'all know that i don't just go right to savings challenges i actually pay my bills and do other stuff that I feel like is a necessity to my family, okay? So I'm just going to update y'all on that for May, okay? So for the truck, the debt on the truck, I am going to be trying to pay that off by July, you know, by the end of July. And so far, let me see, I think I wrote down here what we owe. So we owe $3,599 as of today, June 13th, because I actually... um looked at all this stuff before I came on here and showed y'all. So $3,599 and I always round up y'all. So I'm just going to say $3,600 for the truck. Okay. So that's what we owe. And I have a savings challenge that I'm going to be trying to do to um, get this paid off. Okay. Now for our ortho, which we are about to pay this off but she um is about to have surgery this last um let me see how much this is one two three fifty seventy seventy two seventy four seventy six seventy eight so that's three thousand seventy eight three thousand fifty seventy two four six eight yeah three thousand seventy eight and we owe I wrote it back here, y'all. So the total was three thousand one hundred and eighty after our insurance, and we paid three thousand seventy eight. So now we owe one hundred and two dollars. So that will be paid this month. So we'll have that portion paid off, but then she will possibly have to have surgery for her, uh, you know, the back wisdom teeth, y'all. So we want to go ahead on and get that out the way. So we still owe. What was it? I'm supposed to be writing this stuff down, y'all, and I'm not. One or two left on this. That's what we owe. I'm sorry, y'all. I'm trying to write and not knock nothing down, too. Okay? So, we're doing pretty good on our debt. And once we... That's not our only debt. We got one more after that, which is the parent student loan that we had got for our oldest daughter. So, once we pay all this off, we'll start paying on that. Okay? And so, then in investing... When I'm talking about investing, we're doing the 
Cash App and the M1 Finance for this, y'all. Um, I hope to get on another platform because I love the Vanguards. Uh, my husband retirement in 401k is basically with Vanguard, and I love those, you know. So I'm hoping to actually get on their platform as well. So in investing, we have 1,000, 2,000, 3,000, 50, 52. So 3,052 is so far what we have um, for investing. And that's just Cash App and M1 Finance. You know you got to start somewhere. And y'all, we just bought two Tesla shares. They said that Tesla was going to be uh, doing a 3-1 split after August, after the meeting. So we're going to try to buy some more uh, shares for that. But I just wanted to give y'all that little info. And then for uh, the savings, which is just the extra savings that we have for the Capital One. Let's see how much we have in that as of today. We have 1,500, so $1,851. And I'm just so proud of us because we would have never been doing none of this without this community, y'all. Mommy Trader and Plan Your One Life, they were the ones that I actually seen all this stuff about investing and, you know, just different stuff um, about not just letting your money sit in your envelopes and, you know, just, I just do more with my envelopes that y'all see on here. Y'all usually see me just putting money in my envelopes, but before I do all that, I actually have money that's being invested and put into savings accounts and stuff like that before I even do all that. So I just didn't want y'all to think that, you know, it's just all fun and games with savings challenges. I mean, you can use savings challenges to do all of that. But for me, I like to pay my bills, my debt, invest and build my savings up. OK, um, but I know, you know, ain't nobody no idiot or nothing like that. But I just didn't want people. You might be new to the game. So I don't want you to just think. That is all about savings challenges and letting your money sit in your envelopes and stuff like that. That's what I'm trying to say, y'all. But anyway, so I wanted to show y'all this little update. And let's see what else. Um, what else I had to say? Oh, the BCL. Y'all, don't forget um, the BCL. And this week, which is week four, we are doing Budget with Crazy and Love. Um, all Things Kimberly. I desire wealth and budget into freedom. That's for week four, y'all. Okay. And I think that is it. So in my next video, I will be showing y'all. Um, what will I be showing y'all? I'll be showing y'all my, um, I think starting my giveaway box uh, thing again. I believe that's what we'll be doing, y'all. But anyway, I just want to show y'all that, you know, you have to start somewhere. And it's not all about savings challenges, okay? You have to handle your business, you know, because, you know, we're trying to do it right. We're trying to do better than what we uh, were possibly taught, you know, because I never knew as a black lady, I never knew anything about investing and stuff like that. So I try to teach my daughters better and stuff like that. But anyway, y'all, I hope this video helped. And I will see y'all in the next one. Have a blessed day.